Hi everybody, it's Jackie with the Blessed Daisy Budgets. We're here for game night tonight. So let's go ahead and count our money so we don't forget. <laughs> we should have 170. We have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110, 20, 30, 35, 45, 55, 60, 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 70. All right, so we are starting out, um, we have no IOUs and nothing left over. So we're going to start here with this first one that is from Danny over at Craft Co. Budgets, and it is a budget bingo. And we're gonna be, since when we roll two dice, we are ending up with the same ones that we've already done. I don't wanna sit here and roll and keep rolling. So actually, you know what I'm gonna do? We're just going to scratch off um, and see how far we can go. Just kind of here in order. Okay, so we have three. And then one. So that's four. And three is seven. And then two, that would be nine. Um, let me, I'll keep going. So nine and then three is 12. Okay, one is 13. We're just gonna go for it. Um, and three, That'll be 16. Okay, and then two is 18. And then next time what we'll do is we'll just go in and color the ones on the back. And uh, we should be finished with this next week. All right. So we have 18. And usually I am in no big rush to finishing new challenges. So we're gonna put back two. We'll take a 20. But I want to kind of try and maybe do a couple less challenges so that maybe the videos will be a little bit faster. Okay, so the next one we have is from Lindsay at Boy Mom Loves to Save. And guys, this is her Feed the Hippos Savings Challenge. We've made it into a game. Uh, so I added these little multipliers to it and then I drew these little arrows. This is the path that I'm going to take when we're rolling. So we're going to roll a six-sided die. We left off here. Oh, and, and a color dot. So we're going to roll both. So we have green, which is times three, and we're moving two spaces. So we're going to go one, two. So whatever we scratch is going to be times three. Okay, so that is two, that's gonna be $6, and we're gonna stop there because I want to kind of focus on a couple of these other challenges back here. So six, we don't have enough ones to make change, so we're gonna put in that five and one. All right, and then this Uno game is one that I created. Um, just going to shuffle a little bit here. And we're just gonna pull one card. That is a blue nine. So let's get that marked off. And we'll go ahead and put our cards away. And this is available as a digital download in our Etsy store. Okay, so I'm gonna put back $1 and take, nope, I'm gonna put back that 10 as well and we're gonna take a 20. And so I designed this to work with my Uno cards, but uh, you should be able to make them work with whatever Uno cards you have. Um, if, you, if there's extra wild cards here, 
Um, you can always put wild cards back in after you draw them, or you just decide to, say you only have four wild cards in yours, you just decide to just cross out two and not do all six of them. Or by the same token, if you have eight wild cards, you can always um, do just six or continue and do eight. All right, so next one we have is from Jenny over at Simply Living Saves. We are just rolling a six-sided die for this. We left off right here and we have three, so one, two, three. That is a small icon for $2. Okay, one, two, and then we have a five, so that's seven. We're gonna stop there for right now. And uh, if you guys can tell, Mr. Matthew's in there talking. We had a um, doctor's appointment earlier today, and so I'm gonna put back these three ones, so seven, and I'm gonna put back these two fives. We're gonna grab a 20. So we had a doctor's appointment earlier today and um, I don't know if it was necessarily bad news, but uh, it wasn't the greatest, um, but it, it wasn't bad. It's, it's kind of weird because um, you think, well, it's either good news or it's bad news. Well, it was kind of in the middle of the road and uh, so yeah, that's, that's all I can really say. Um, all right, so this next one is from Mari over at Budgets and Chaos, and this is so much fun. This is her foam funding mosaic savings challenge. We did get the butterfly and also the bee, but she also had, when I bought these, she had a unicorn and a boat, a sailboat. So I don't know if she's added any more. Um, or if these have sold out or not, but they're super cute. The colors are so vibrant. I love it. We are rolling a color dot die, and the color dot die is going to tell me which one to do. Okay, so we're doing red, which means I get to pick two that I want to, um, to do. I think we are going to pick... total of six. So we will pick a four and a two. Okay, so we're going to do blue and hot pink. Okay, six dollars. I bumped my camera and it stopped recording, so hopefully looks like we're still good. Okay, six. Um, let's, so we're going to take six, but you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put those two fives back and I'm going to switch them out for a 10. All right. Now we come to, I don't know why I just put my dice tray away because we're going to need it. We're come to the shut the box game boards. So let me put this aside. We are going to shut your mini shamrock. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> oh, goodness. Here we go. <laughs> All right. Come on. Let's do this. Okay. So we have a four. All right. And a five. Ooh, and a six. All right, here we go, come on. Well, they, it, when it lands on its corner like that, I mean, I could take the four, but I really just want it to land on what it's supposed to land on. So it was supposed to land on the four. So we will take the three and the one, and let's hope for a two. Nope, we didn't do it, but a two, that is not bad at all. Way better than how I've been playing it. Okay, so let's go again. We have a five and a three. Ooh, 
blue now. <laughs> this is not good. A two. Oh, come on. <laughs> no. Okay, good. Okay, six. All right, come on. Let's shut this mini shamrock. Four. Nope, didn't do it. That's all right, though. Okay, so we have one more shot at shutting our mini shamrock. Okay, come on, let's do this. Four, three. Oh no, four. No. <laughs> oh no. No, 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 we can't do anything. Oh my goodness, it was like, oh yeah, you're feeling yourself, girl. We'll show you. <laughs> All right, so we have. 11 13 14 dollars with that one <laughs> you shut your box is like mm -mm, girl teach you to get all full of yourself <laughs> all right so we have 18 20 dollars total that will be going into that one and yay we finished that so that's cool um let's go ahead and because i don't want to forget to put the money in there because you know I will all right so 10 and 20 so guys we were able to save 20 40 50 65 dollars with shut your mini shamrock so much fun and I did not bring any clips with me that's okay we'll just set it aside and we're ready for next month Next game night, we're going to be starting our autism awareness challenges. So excited. Um, we have a lot of those. So let's go now to shut your lucky box. Let's, let's do that one. And guys, I almost forgot to add a dollar to the ding, ding, ding challenge. This was created by Donna over at Donna Powered by Creativity. You can find this as a free download on her channel. For every time you uh, complete a savings challenge, you ring a bell and you save a dollar. All right, let's see. Let's go to see how Shut Your Lucky Box treats us today. Oh boy, these games are so much fun. I love these games. Okay, we have seven. We will take the seven. Six, we will take the six. Oh no, two. We have no choice. Five, we'll take the five. Come on, high numbers, high numbers. Nine, okay, we will take the nine. Let's get an eight, come on here, let's get an eight or a 12, that'll work too. Eight, nice, okay. So we just sweet talk our little dice here. Okay, how about, ooh, so we are under, we're under, Six. So let's switch down to using one die, and it's a three, so we'll take the three. Come on, four. Oh, five. Oh, we can still do it. Oh my gosh, guys. We shut the box, and I almost didn't realize it. That's amazing. Yay. <laughs> That's right, buddy. Yay. <laughs> That's nice, sweet. All right, it's been a hot minute since I've shut the box, so this is awesome. All right, let's keep this going. All right, we have nine, we'll take the nine. Okay, and eight, we will take the eight. Nine, we will, what will we do? Um. We'll take the seven and the two. Oh, I always wonder if that's a mistake, you know? Okay, so we're six and under, but I think I'm gonna continue to roll two dice. And we have a four, we will take that. 
we have seven, so I will take the six and one because we don't have a choice. I will, I'm gonna roll two, I hope for an eight. Uh, it's four. So um, yeah, but that's only eight, so that's pretty good. That's pretty good, all right. So we'll do eight there. Ooh, okay guys, <laughs> we're gonna go again. We're going again. Nine, we will take the nine. Nine, oh boy. I hate to get rid of the one, so. Oh my goodness, what do we do? Let's do the seven and the two. You know, you never know what's gonna be the right thing to do. Um, this one is kind of on its corner, but it's mostly, I can see that it's one, so we'll take it, and that is four. Um, so I'll take the four. 12. Oh no. 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 <laughs> oh no, no, no. <laughs> we can't do anything. Ouch. <laughs> this is, is going to hurt. We have, oh my gosh, we have 1524. Is that right? No, sorry. We have 14, 19, 23, uh, 23, 24 really doesn't make that big of a difference. So guys, I think that pretty much tells us that we need to move on to a different game maybe. Whew. Yeah, that's, uh... oh my gosh, should we play one more time? Okay, we're gonna play one more time. One more. <laughs> Uno mas. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Oh no, okay. We have two, okay, let's. <laughs> okay, 10. Oh boy. I hate to get rid of the one. Um, Oh my gosh. Let's do the nine and the one. That's probably a huge mistake. 12. We can do the eight and the four. We could have done the seven and five, but I think we're gonna stick with eight and four. Oh, another 12. So we can do the seven and the five. We're gonna go ahead and roll two dice and hope for a nine. Five, six, seven. Nope. That's okay, we will put nine and... <laughs> okay, let's regroup and see where we're at. So we're so far we're at $41, is that right? So we have 33.41. Let's go ahead and we will, let's put this over here. We will put, the 41 in, shut your lucky box. <laughs> I seriously could just play this all night. Just the one game. So 41, okay, so 10, 20, 30, 41. Yes, Mr. Matthew is pretty excited <laughs> about this. <laughs> He's like, that's right, mom, get some money together for my van. Okay, so let's play some feeling lucky. Oh my goodness. So this is, um, we have a lot of the different versions of Shut the Box on our, um, in our Etsy store. This one here, Shut Your Lucky Box, it does have a very um, strong St. Patrick's Day theme to it. However, there's some things on there for Ireland and I thought this might be a nice Nice one if you say want to save to go to Ireland. Um, this might be a fun way to do that. Also, the shut your shamrocks and shut your mini shamrock, or even the feeling lucky. Um, they don't necessarily have to be just played for St. Patrick's Day. Um, 
I'm going to continue to play this, of course, until they're done. Um, but they could be anything, anything you want them to go towards. Um, if you if you like playing them, you can continue, which is what I'm going to do. I'm not um, really too set on. Uh, well, this is a Valentine's Day challenge, or this is a New Year's challenge. Let's you know it's, we should be done with it, but. I'll play Halloween all year, I'll do, you know, I don't care. If I think that the challenge is cute, I'm gonna be um, playing it. <laughs> all right. We left off here because we haven't even made it around the board yet. So let's see, let's see how far we can go tonight. All right, so five, we have one, two, three, four, five, that is $1. We're gonna put back one dollar. Uh, make sure you guys can see this. Okay, and then six. So one, two, three, four, five, six is three dollars. So we'll put back three more. So we have one, two, and three. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. That is a three. Let's go ahead and bring back two ones. We will put back a five. And one is, you've been pinched, roll a die and add four, but we've already landed on it. And this time I said we were just gonna land on them once. So what we're gonna do is we've landed on this one and this one, and we're going to go to the next one. So that is $1. Okay, and six, um, one, two, three, four, five, six. That is three dollars. Let's bring back two and that five, and we will take that ten. Okay, so one, two, and three. That is luck of the Irish. Save any amount. Um. Since we're only going to go land on them one time, I'm gonna put back five, I'm gonna say five. Okay, and then one is Kiss Me I'm Irish, roll a die from a big green lips. And then you're gonna save that amount. So that is two, so we'll put back $2. One, two, three, and four. That is Luck of the Irish, save any amount. Um, let's see we have one two we have one two three dollars here um let's go ahead and just do the five again six we have one two three four five six and that is luck of the iris saving amount we will do the five again um, let's go again one two three four. Oh boy we have luck of the iris tonight we're gonna do uh, five again for that. One, two, three, four, and five. You've pinched someone wearing green socks, they pinch you back, save five dollars. You have to be careful about that. So many times that's happened. <laughs> three, we have one, two, three. You've been pinched, you're gonna roll a die and add four. So that is seven, we're gonna do five, six and seven, and we're going to, um, we're gonna maybe stop there for right now because we can possibly finish another challenge. So let me see what we're gonna be adding to this tonight. We are adding Oops, I put that 10 in there. So tonight we're gonna to be adding 10, 15, 25, 35, 40, one, two, three, four, and five, 45. Okay, so now let's go back to, we are gonna skip Villainopoly tonight. Um, just because we have a pretty good start on that, and um, 
it's going to be randomized into Disney Dreams. So we're not in any big huge hurry on that since we really don't have any Disney plans. Uh, it's just a dream. So let's see what we need here. We mark these off. And it looks like we need $16 to complete this. We have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and we have $2 left over. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, I will just color these in off camera or um, I don't really feel the need to color them in since it's gonna be completed and we know that we've saved it. So let's go ahead and see what we have saved total between the front and the back. Okay, so we've saved 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 30, 45, 55, 56, 7, 8, 9, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, that is nice. So we say 165, so 75 on the front and 90 on the back. So that does um, that does come out with the, the correct amount. And we finished another challenge. So that's awesome. I was hoping we would be able to um, maybe come back to this one. All right, so I will remove that. And then next time we will have this. I don't think I actually have anything for just, oh, I do. I have, I can do a $2 right here. Okay, so that is what I have for you guys tonight. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. Really appreciate you. Um, let's go ahead and add another dollar to the ding, ding, ding challenge. I can grab it here. And we empty this out every month when we reallocate our savings challenges to Matthew's Ride. This goes in there as well. So um, we should be doing that here pretty soon. We have the envelope here. I don't have any clips, paper clips with me, but that's okay. We will just stick it in here on top and I can clip it later. All right. So I do have a couple of things of Happy Mail. I'm just going to try and sneak in a couple of them here and there. Um, try not to make the videos too long, but this one I received from T&L Budgets. Um, I placed an order with them and of course it was crammed into my mailbox. Um, so. I did open it, but I haven't pulled anything out. Uh, but I could tell from the packaging that they, it had been like kind of crushed, which is unfortunate. But this is a challenge that was created by um, a child, by Peyton. And so I believe, I haven't gone and checked. Let me make sure I have everything out of here. I haven't been there to check, but I believe there's another challenge that has was coming. It might be there um, on their in their Etsy store now. But how cute is this? Is that just not adorable? Um, see if there's anything on back. There is not anything on back. So um, looks like we have some St. Patrick's Day challenges again I you know just because this is St. Patrick's Day it doesn't mean that I can't use it now and then this cute little bear scratch off as a thank you and then we also have these so we have the C challenge the denominations are 1 through 10 and I'm not seeing how much it totals and then we have jungle savings. Again, the denominations are one through 10. Tropical challenge. And then pink passion. So these are very pretty. And then let's see what's in this. Try not to be all savage and tear into it. 
All right. Oh, cute. Teach, love, inspire. Oh, life is a highway. Life is a highway. <laughs> you have to know that's going to get edited out. <laughs> I want to drive it all night long. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> this just struck me in that. I'm sorry, but like songs just come into my head. When I see something and songs come into my head, I can't help it. Often my husband is like, how do you know that song? <laughs> when I start singing like Sir Mix-a-Lot or something, he's like, how is it you know that song? And how is it that you know all of the words to Ice Ice Baby? And I'm like, uh, <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> All right, stop. No, no, don't start, Jackie. Okay, how cute. Oh my gosh, another little bear with the little black scratch-offs. Oh. Oh, that is the, that's like the start of a money tree right there. Oh, and a thank you for supporting small business. Oh, all right. We're gonna have to do some editing. I just showed you guys my address. <laughs> Look how sweet is that. I got a personal note, handwritten, from, I am assuming, and it's probably not a, a big stretch, but this is from Peyton. Peyton, you are welcome so much. I love your challenge. I just want to thank you for creating such a wonderful challenge that is just so cute and very creative. So thank you very much. All right, so that is what we're going to show for Happy Mail this time. And then, um, no it's not, Jackie. Guys, I have one more thing I want to show you. So last year we, we did Mare Bear 3000's um, challenge for the Bethany um, Children's Hospital or Health Center. And they send me things now and again because I made that donation to them. And oh my gosh, look at this sweet little nugget. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, my heart, my heart, As, oh, my heart. I just want to just give him just the biggest little hug and just snuggle with him. Oh my goodness, he's so adorable. His name is Reuben, and I'm sure you could um, read about Reuben and his family. There's the QR code, and um, you can use that to watch their story. But this is his adoptive family here. Oh my goodness sakes. Oh, so sweet. And of course, Ruben knows that green is my favorite color. So he dressed in green and... <laughs> All right, he, he probably didn't know. But you do now, honey. All right, I had to show you, the, you guys that... Um, Bethany's Children Health Center. So when I donate again, it'll be to them, as well as all of these great causes that we are raising money for. I kind of feel like maybe one of the months we can do something for Bethany Children's Health Center. Um, so May is gonna be for lupus. I really haven't had time to go much further than that. I do have some other months already lined out but I don't I don't see a reason why we wouldn't be able to do something for Bethany Children's Hospital or I keep saying hospital it's health center but um, that way we can maybe sell some challenges and raise some money to donate to them again this year and this is who you're helping um, when we get those challenges this is who you'll be helping Our cute little nuggets like Reuben here all right, that's all I have for you guys. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you spending your time here with me. Really appreciate all of my subscribers. Um, 
you guys show me so much support. I just, I can't say enough. I, I really just truly appreciate each and every one of you. Truly, truly do. If you're here watching, you're not a subscriber, thank you. I really appreciate you as well. Um, it does help my channel when you watch, even though you're not subscribed, but it's gonna help even more if you do. Um, hit that subscribe button, and when you do, make sure you also hit that bell notification so YouTube will let you know when we upload another video. If you like this video, hit that like button. Let me know that you did. If you know anybody that might like this content, please feel free to share. That would be amazing. And until next time, I hope everybody is having the most blessed day ever. Bye.